Hello everybody, um, I will now present to you a brief instruction film on how to use the HemoQ for the measurement of hemoglobin. In the package that you received you will find the machine itself, which can be operated by battery or by power cord. I strongly recommend the power cord for this purpose. Um, or alternatively you can use batteries. As you can see here, that's uh, four AA batteries. The machine measures the hemoglobin values within a couple of minutes only. In a first step, make sure that the corresponding microcuvettes are not expired. When opening a new box of microcuvettes, indicate the date when the box was opened. Since the micro are only um, can only be used for up to 30 days. Remove a single micro from the container. Collect a drop of capillary blood from your patient. It is quite essential here that a, you make sure that you use sterile techniques for collecting the blood and secondly that you wipe off any remaining alcohol three times before using the actual blood. So this is the third drop. Now you take the micro -cuvette. It shouldn't be underfilled as you can see here. It should be completely filled. There should be no air bubbles in there. Make sure there is no blood on the outside and then enter the micro -cuvette into the bio uh, into the hemoq i'm sorry wait for a couple of minutes and then record the result can you note that the micro cuvette can only be entered in one orientation into the machine remove the micro cuvette and dispose of it as a biohazardous item and switch the hemoq off and this is basically done i'm going to skip this part because this talks about how to process venous blood samples which we will not be using Once in a while, the machine will require and will need to be cleaned. Switch off the machine. As you can see here, you can remove the, the, the receptacle of the micro -cuvette and then clean it with a slightly moist paper without using any aggressive detergents. You can also clean the outside if you want to. Afterwards, kindly wait for at least 15 minutes until all components are completely dry again. Then put the receptacle back in and you should be done. Once in a while you will also see this error 02 and this indicates that the inside of the machine is dirty. In this case, kindly, very carefully and gently clean the machine from the inside, wait for 50 minutes until everything is completely dry and then close the machine. However, we very much hope that you will not have to clean the machine from the inside, especially if the micro cuvettes are being cleaned from the outside prior to entering into the machine. This should be fine. Thank you very much for your attention.